Hello and welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm Tripwire and this is Super Mario Maker 2. I'm going to do the same thing for this level. Nope, the same thing for this level that I did for this level. So you guys might remember the video, 4 Red Coins Easy Peasy. It was called my my uploading my best level or my best level so far. Um, Steve is still the only one to clear it. One out of 484 attempts. So that one's pretty tough. Uh, and then I made this one, which is tougher. I called it the Friendship Ender because I played it with making Steve beat it in mind. Um, but same theme, you have to complete four different trials to get coins to unlock the, the final door. Um, I think this one's a little bit better designed even than the last one. Um, but since it's uploaded already and I can just play it with checkpoints properly, I figured I'd show it off to you guys in a reasonably length video, hopefully. So here goes the French better. Nobody's beaten this one yet. I think it has 150 attempts. Nobody's beaten this one, but it's similar. Start off in this little room, go through a pipe to the sub area, hit your checkpoint, and then you choose your trials. There are four of them as before. And uh, so let's get into it. The trials are not necessarily in ascending difficulty, but the reason I called it the Friendship Ender is because not only are the trials difficult, but you do the entire level right to left, which is kind of like the bane of any platform player, platformer player. We are so used to our platformers going left to right that going right to left is actually a huge detriment. Uh, I'm gonna do this part the way I intended. Steve picked up on a cheese that I myself did not. Okay. Well, I don't know what happened to the other shell, but most of the time if you do it fast enough, that other shell still stays spawned in and they kill each other. But what you're supposed to do there is race the big shell, get there after it has killed the chomp, but before it has killed the block, because you need what's in the block. So, do that again, but better. Better, better, Chase. Do it again, but better. That was worse. That was the opposite of what we were going for. But anyway, there, yeah, there are four trials, all left or right to left and all with some pretty tough mechanics in them i just wanted to have like varying come on dude you're floating on nothing all right well i'm not gonna have the benefit of the small shell what i gotta do is beat the shell here it kills the ch momentum dude momentum please uh, fuck me I should have practiced a level before recording it, but what you're getting is the unadulterated, unwarmed up chase. I mean, I just, I just recorded an expert endless video, but like, that doesn't prepare you for a level like this. Fuck me. I'm actually worse at my own level than everybody else is now, I, I think. I mean, I've, I've made like three levels since this one. I haven't practiced it at all since then, but like, damn dude, I'm disappointing myself. That is, I, I won't feel bad about dying there. That part's uh, mean. I made that, so I can admit it. That part's mean. <laughs> if you don't bounce off the Koopa and center yourself perfectly, then you just die and there's nothing you can do about it. You have to have the exact right amount of momentum doing that part. Are you fucking kidding me? I always used to do it this way. I don't know what's happening. Oh, man. Well, this video is going to be longer than I wanted it to be. Maybe that's a good thing. Maybe you guys will appreciate the extra minutes of content. Oh, no. <laughs> I could explain what happened in my brain there, but wouldn't change the facts. Nothing would change. Everything's terrible. Life is pain. Mario's life is pain. I mean, you can't even argue with this. Mario's life is pain. This is his life. He just does shit like this all the time. All right. So you gotta beat the shell. Oh, so that's what's supposed to happen if you're fast enough. The, uh, the fucking small shell comes back and kills it. Oh, and also in all these trials, you need to keep extra HP that is given to you at the end because there is a blade at the end of each one. So you have to complete all the trials without taking damage. All right, there we go. One coin out. Acquired. Shouldn't have taken me five minutes. I apologize. What are you gonna do? Round number two. Um, this one used to be the worst. Now it's the most forgiving because even like even to me while trying to upload it, it was unfair. 
how hard it was to keep your extra HP. So I made it so that there is two things of extra HP in this level. You can get hurt and then just grab the second one if you want. So I'm going to take damage here and just grab the helmet because being big doesn't really help you for this part. Those are tough because people may not be ready to spin jump after each of those. And if you don't spin jump, you land on the spike beneath you and you lose your helmet too early. See how that trial took me one try compared to the five minutes the other trial took me? Yeah, it's a little silly. A little silly. There we go, two trials done. Uh, the third one, I'm trying to remember what even goes on in the third one. It's been a while. Ah, uh, yes, the third one was supposed to be like pseudo speedrun. I was supposed to duck there, I didn't duck. I didn't put an arrow or anything indicating that I was supposed to duck. It's my bad. But yeah, so since this is my level, it won't count as a clear. It'll still count as nobody has beaten this level. Ah, shit. Okay, this, uh, this first section here is easy to make it the amount of time. I mean, it is if you don't fuck up the jump like four times like I did. As it was, I was super close to still making it, but you gotta keep your helmet. Uh, the hard part of that trial is at the very end, but I'll show that to you and, well, hopefully on this attempt. Okay, that spring doesn't always work. It depends on how fast you're going when you approach it. All right, so you gotta do this, and then you gotta do this. And then you have to- No! You have to race the thwomp. Racing the thwomp uh, isn't super difficult once you get ahead of it, but it's a matter of getting ahead of it without losing your helmet and then starting the race part because you need the helmet for the end. So it's a delicate thing to get ahead of it safely to start without taking damage from it first because it's very tight uh, positioning between you and uh, Mr. Thwampy Boy. So you do that. Just stay ahead of him, and you gotta get through here before the P-switch expires, and with your health. Easy peasy. Alright. Three quarters of the way done already. This video is gonna be shorter than I expected, actually. Uh, the final trial, I would not say is the hardest one, but it might be the hardest one for anybody who's new to it, just because... They won't know my intended route. Little do they know, the intended route is to fall directly into the lava. Fuck on that, haters. Right, clearly I fucked up, but... Then it's just a star run and then you're done. There you go. That's all there is to it. But anyway, I feel like it's a pretty well designed level. It looks nice. Uh, I think it's the most nicely laid out, nicely decorated level I've uploaded so far, and I think it's definitely harder than the last one. Um, it, it'll really mess with people's heads having to go right to left in a lot of cases. So doing tough trials right to left is certainly... Uh, it's like a guarantee that this will never be in... Anything less than Super Expert. Although I think every one of my levels is in Super Expert, technically. But, so yeah, still no completion, because I don't count. So yeah, quick quick little one-off video. Beat that level quicker than I expected. Um, it's also very sad to me that I spent five minutes, or like four and a half minutes on the first trial, because that means that the other three trials took place within like four or five minutes themselves. Which is stupid. Um, I also made this one, which is just like, you see the... The thumbnail preview there it's just like i made i played with the slope object because i didn't have that mario maker one i just made some interesting shapes and then i put spikes everywhere and made it so that you have to navigate uh and jump across all the shapes to get to the end um but real quick before i go i also just finished making another course along the lines of complete four tough trials here it is um i'll give you a little preview just like i did last time so same deal you know you can go to the right there, but there's no point. The temptation. Okay, yeah, same deal here, you know, four trials. 
Um, but these ones are in Super Mario World, uh, Brothers 1. And they're just more about jumping and, like, precision. Because there's fewer mechanics, you can't, like, grab items or anything. I'm dead. But yeah, this is gonna be- this one's gonna be a bitch to upload, to be honest, because this is the first and easy trial. And once again, I used the entire, um, horizontal space in the sub-area for the trials. With some pretty good mechanics, I feel like. But, uh, yeah, there's- there's your preview. That's all you get. I'm excited to, uh, get that one uploaded. And when the time comes, I'll probably do a video like this, playing through that one for you guys. So, thank you so much for watching the Mario content. Hope you've enjoyed it, and I'll see you for the next video. Hopefully. Bye.